That had to be the worst Dollar Tree I've ever been to in my entire life. And I've been to some Dollar Trees, girl. Hi friends, I'm at a new to me Dollar Tree girl and I'm ready to go in here and see what they have new for December 2018 at Dollar Tree. Plus get a few crafts maybe for my girls um, to do for the Christmas time. And, and I just watched Catherine from Do It On A Dime's um, latest video where she did this five minute craft. It was like a super cheap Dollar Tree craft and it was so cute and it, it motivated me and my non-crafty self to try and try it um, hopefully they'll have the things I don't know you know every Dollar Tree is a hit or a miss I've never been to this Dollar Tree so let's get in there and see what they got also I'm on my lunch break for work you guys know I have a track record with this and I'm not very successful on getting out in 30 minutes but I set my timer for 30 minutes 30 minutes only to get in here see what they got and get my butt back to work okay off the bat this Dollar Tree is a hot mess compared to the Dollar Trees that are closer to my house this Dollar Tree is closer to my job it's like 10 minutes away and it's just a disorganized mess but we're gonna push through we're gonna push through this is cute they have hardly nothing <laughs> hanging up I don't know why it's such a mess. Is it a mess because the people coming here make it a mess? Or is it a mess because the employees don't keep up with it? I don't know. No, this is really cute. This DIY tote bag and the girls can like color it themselves. I'm gonna think about it because stuff like this just turns into clutter, y'all. You know I've been on this decluttering kick. Well, if you didn't know, you can tap the eye in the upper right hand corner, but I've been trying to slowly declutter my home. This is really cute if, you go, if you're going to any Christmas parties. I'm um, having a wine bottle bag for a dollar. Super cute. These are cute stocking stuffers. Um, I'm just gonna get my girls a couple of LOL dolls for their stocking stuffers. Cause like this little stuff, even though they're cute and cheap stocking stuffers, um, it just turns into clutter and I'll be getting rid of it in, you know, six months you know I'm trying not to do that I know they love their lol dolls and they try at least they try to take care of them like seriously why is this Dollar Tree just so dirty it makes me not even want to shop it's so dirty I'm just still gonna push through though this is cute this pen as a stocking stuffer or is it a pencil I think it's a pen let's see yeah it's a pen but again, I'm trying not to like just buy useless things, so I don't know. We'll think about it. I love these. Um, I like the colors that they have here. They're only a dollar, but if you go to Walmart, you get five of them for $9.99, so it's way cheaper to buy it here. We do a lot of learning at home, so that's good to like organize workbooks and worksheets, whatever I want them to work on for the week. Oh, no. Wow, who knew they had sparkle color glue sticks? I need to just up my craft game. I had no idea. My kids would love that though, but I don't let them play with the glue stick. Um, all right, so I bought one of these last week and I'm gonna buy another one and I may be, you know, shooting myself in the foot for my girls um, because they just love this stuff. It's a mess, but they just love it and they'll stay busy for a long time with it. And I think um, I'm just gonna give it to them going to stick to my plan of only um, using um, stocking their stocking stuffers with lol dolls on uh, this like those little markers or glue sticks I'm gonna give to them um, you know as an activity to do during the weekend now a couple of Sunday setups ago I can't I think two you can tap this eye right here it was the Sunday set this eye right here it was a Sunday setup where we um, organized the dining room and I said, guys, don't let me buy any more learning activities. And look at where I'm at right now. Books, you know, I am going to pick this up because I think it's good practice for them or for Zara, my oldest, but uh, they want, they need more coloring books though. They do need that because they haven't, colored they don't have any um more coloring books like they use them all i just want you guys to see how dirty it is in here look the floor i just don't understand 
why it's so dirty. Like, I've never been to a Dollar Tree where it's this bad. I was hoping to find the Say Yes to Carrots masks, face masks here, because I hear they're really good. I don't see them, though. I've bought these several times for my girls. I really like them. They're cute, cheap washcloths. These are great to, to buy here. These storage bags, are they Ziploc storage or no? Oh no, if they're not Ziploc storage, then forget it. You need the, not Ziploc storage, oh here they are, the vacuum storage bags. These are really good. Does it matter the brand of hydrogen peroxide or alcohol that you get? I know you can get a higher percentage than 50%, but what about hydrogen peroxide? Leave a comment down below and let me know, because I'd rather just get it here, because I do need a bottle. Instead of, instead of spending a couple dollars at like Target or Walmart. Wow, look at these. I don't need these at all, but if this brand is like a well-known brand. You get them for a dollar here. Oh, look at the hydrogen peroxide spray. Even though it's a smaller bottle, I mean, does it really make sense? Cause you can just buy a spray bottle to put the hydrogen peroxide in, but I think I'm just gonna get this instead of this huge bottle here. Band-Aids are always good to get from here. Let's see what they have. Jurassic World, PJ Masks, Sesame Street, and Barbie. Can never go wrong with Barbie with my girls. So I'm gonna get that. Look at this. Beauty cream, intensive cream. This probably, probably would be great hand cream. Should I get it? I don't need any more lotions. I'm trying, y'all. I am trying not to just buy useless stuff that just ends up being, you know, in the way. Oh, I found them. Here they are. All right, I'm going to try this. Okay, I'm going to try this one and this one and this one. Seriously? <laughs> Tricks makes lip gloss. It's funny. This is cute. Stocking stuff or two. Lip gloss. This is so cute. Do not touch my stuff. I should get this for my office. Okay, I don't need anything from this aisle, but I just always feel like I have to walk down here. I didn't know they sold detangling brushes here. I wonder how good it is. Oh my gosh, I just decluttered my bathroom, y'all. This is how it starts. Should I try it? Because I kind of don't like the one that I have, but... Oh, just let, I'm just gonna let it go. I'm gonna let it go. I'm gonna stop. Just stop myself. I'm a sucker for a good comb, y'all. I like these, but the ones that I have that I get from like Walmart, they have like a little knob on here and it helps with not breaking your hair off. I know, I know, but this one looks really good. It doesn't have the little knob, but you can tell it's, it's like a softer finish. I know you guys are probably thinking, really, Gia? I'm a sucker for a good comb. Okay, just this, that's it. I'm not gonna get that tangling brush though because that is like, you just, that's a risk because you just don't know how that's gonna be. But this, I know for sure. I feel it in my spirit that's gonna work good. My keto self is just gonna say heck no to this over here. I'm just gonna say no to it. I've been doing good on my keto reboot. If you haven't found out, if you hadn't heard what happened and how much weight I gained since Halloween, you can tap this out right here. This can't be it for the organizers. Huh. Where are they? Let me see. Maybe I'm missing something, but this can't be it. I've literally walked the whole store. This is it for the organizers. Wow, this is really crappy. Oh, can you do? Oh, look at this. Oh, I've never seen this here before. What is it? Oh, it has like a cute little. Um, pull out here fridge storage bin. This is nice. This is like comparable to um, Something they sell at the container store, but I'm just trying to think what would you put in here? Like a can of soda or something. It's so small They only have That size here that I just showed you And, <clears throat> and then they also have the nice drawer organizers. It's so dusty in here. It's like getting in my throat <coughs> These little Christmas Boxes are cute. Really cute. These are actually really pretty. They have like a gold rim around. It's a pretty set. Of course they have the gold chargers. 
Just gold though, that's it. These are cute um, Christmas socks. Look at this, so cute. Oh look, they have the little houses here. They don't light up or anything. Well, I, hmm, actually you can, I guess, put a light in there? Like a single light bulb? I'm not sure. It's cute though, really cute. These extra large jumbo coloring books are super cute for Christmas, but they're just like, after Christmas, are my kids gonna want to continue to color it? I don't know, I guess I could pull it out every year, but let's see. It's so big. I'm coming. It's cute. I'm gonna think about it. Gosh, the line is so long. I want to buy this so bad and eat it. But, nope, I'll say no. That had to be the worst Dollar Tree I've ever been to in my entire life. And I've been to some Dollar Trees, girl. Okay, I had to move my car because um, the light was just crazy. Anyway, yeah, that was the worst Dollar Tree I've ever been to in my entire life. Let me quickly show you what I got. I was on time, but the lady was so slow checking out. I'm now running late, so I'm going to quickly run through this. I got this because, listen, everybody likes a little home DIY foot, foot spa massage from time to time um and this is something quick you could like do when you're in the shower and stuff so i bought that i bought some learning books y'all on it i bought this one for zara time and money it's just great practice i bought them two coloring books a my little pony and a care bear i bought this test prep for Ava because I think it's good that because you can practice bubbling in your answers which is great it's kindergarten though so I won't do that with her until next year and then this one for Zara first grade I bought another one of these this Tootsie Roll as like a special treat I can give to my girls from time to time I bought th how many of these three no Four, yes to well carrots or tomatoes or whatever these sleeping masks I'm really excited to try these and I can't wait to let you guys know how I like them make sure you follow me on Instagram so that I can show you and let you know how I like them um, the link for my Instagram is in the description box I bought myself some gum instead of the Godiva chocolate I'm gonna try this comb out and I ended up buying <clears throat> two of these bags as a Christmas craft to do with my girls because that's literally the only craft thing that they had there which was strange um oh I also bought the hydrogen peroxide spray and some Barbie band-aids all together I spent a grand total of $19 even $19 even so that's it. I will never waste my hour of my lunch to go to that Dollar Tree again, and I'll just stick to the Dollar Trees that are closer to my house. But leave a comment down below and let me know what did you find in your Dollar Tree. They didn't have any Christmas crafts, and I'm really upset because I really wanted to try to do some of those Christmas crafts because they were so cool. Maybe I'll try to go to the Dollar Tree by my house and see what they have. Leave a comment down below and let me know if you've done any Dollar Tree crafts or if you have anything new in your Dollar Tree for December. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, you can tap my picture up above, and you can also check out my previous video right over here and all of my social media platforms all listed down below thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye